Mariners. So back at it again today. I made it through those storms okay last night. We had, I guess there was a bunch of tornadoes that touched down, but none of them near me, thankfully. Today we have pretty bad winds. This morning it was really windy. Um, <clears throat> so I didn't get out here this morning. It's now one o'clock. And I'm gonna try and get as much of this done as possible. I'm supposed to go live at four today, so it's Saturday. So we'll see if I can uh, get a signal to go live. But for now, what I'm doing, so I got that far and now I need to start framing. So I got my, my table saw set up out here and I'm gonna start ripping some two by fours. Uh, they're pressure treated two by fours so I can finish the framing on this side and hopefully on the other side. Once I get the framing done, then I'll start cutting skirting boards and putting them up. But I wanna get it all framed first, at least framed to the decks um, because the rest of the framing, of course, means moving all this stuff. Let me take you around to the other side and show you what I got going on there. <clears throat> Today she's got a stick instead of a rock. That's a good thing. But yeah, so I want to get this side framed. I could probably get it framed past the skirting. I mean, past the, the deck. I'm not going to be skirting the deck or the steps because that's just a temporary porch. But uh, I want to get the skirting up all the way around. So I'll try and get all this um, framed in and ready for the boards. And then all I have to do is start cutting the boards and putting them up. So that's what I'm going to be working on today. I will put you guys on time lapse and let's see what I get done. The race was to get it done by Monday. All of it enclosed. That's not going to happen. So uh, I'll get as much of it done as I can. And, uh, and hopefully the insurance company doesn't cancel me for not having it all done. <laughs> all right, I will check back in with you.
Okay, dreamers, not sure where that other video cut off at because my battery died in the middle of working, which is kind of par for the course. <laughs> but this is where I'll end the video finally. So I got to here. I ran out of two by fours, so I need more two by fours to do the framing. So I went from there, got all this back half done to here. Got the front done, y'all yeah, already saw that. And then I got to here on the front and then I ran out of nails for the nail gun. So I have to go get two by fours and nails. And of course today's Sunday, so the uh, hardware store isn't open today. So I will get back on this probably Tuesday. But I did get this side all framed up. It's framed up underneath the skirting. So I just need to get uh, four more two by fours. So I can finish the skirting around the corner and a bunch of nails. <laughs> Cause apparently this stuff blows through nails very quickly. Here's the old skirting. So if you want to do vinyl skirting and have it look like that, uh, I myself prefer the wood look. Plus I'm not going to have metal siding on this trailer when I'm done, trailer mobile, sorry. Uh, when I'm done with it, I will be putting another kind of siding on. I haven't decided exactly what, probably T111 if the prices keep going the way that they are. But yeah, that's basically what I got done so far. I think it's a huge improvement to just having the whole underside of your trailer showing. So I will check in on this project with you guys when I get back on it. It'll probably be Tuesday or Wednesday next week because I got a surprise coming for you all another little side thing I was working on. So hopefully uh, I will be able to go live on Tuesday and share with you guys that surprise and then uh, get back to work on this. Thanks for watching and tune in for the next one.